Hi, I'm Lauren Carter with Burton & Burton, and today I'm going to show you how to make this gorgeous hot air balloon design, perfect for Valentine's Day, birthdays, or baby showers. You'll only need a few products to get started. One three-foot latex balloon of your color choice, ultra high float, one small basket, here I'm using one with a width of four inches, one balloon net, one foil weight, and curling ribbon. I've started by treating a three foot balloon with ultra high flow and then inflating it with helium. I've tied it to a foil weight about a foot or a foot and a half above the weight. Remember, you wanna keep it low so you have just enough space above the basket for your present and for the presentation to look proportionate. Next, we're gonna create some rigging points on the basket using curling ribbon. We're gonna do two in the front and one in the back. I've chosen some white curling ribbon because I think we'll be able to hide the mechanics a little bit better in this design. I'm gonna cut about a foot of curling ribbon and I'm just gonna thread it through the basket, through the weave. Once it's threaded through the basket, just tie a knot to secure it. leaving two tails on either side. Remember, we're gonna do one more in the front and one in the back. Once you have all three rigging points attached to your basket, it's time to simply drop the weight into the basket. I'm gonna add a little shred to further hide our mechanics. I've selected pink to go with our Valentine's Day theme, but you can use any color you want. Make sure to use enough to cover your weight and give it a little bit more volume. Next, we're gonna unwrap our balloon net. Once you have unraveled the net, find the center. That's gonna go on top of the balloon. Next, we're gonna lay the net over the top of the balloon, making sure to find the center. When you get it to the top of the balloon, even out, the net a little bit, sometimes it can favor one side. And it's as easy as that. Once you have the net draped over the balloon, you're gonna section it off into three different areas for three different rigging points. I'm gonna do four strings per rigging point. So one, two, three, four, and this is gonna go in the front. And I'm simply gonna use the curling ribbon to tie it into the basket. Make sure you get it nice and tight so it doesn't float away. And we're gonna cut off the excess. And do this for each rigging point. Once you have all rigging points secured, we're gonna cut off any excess of the balloon net and any of the curling ribbon that's showing. Then we're gonna hide the mechanics with some ribbon. I've used some satin corsage ribbon to create bows to help disguise the mechanics on each one of my rigging points. Here I've made each bow and I've dovetailed the ends for a finished look. I'm gonna secure them with a U-glue dash. Once all your rigging points are secured, and camouflage with our ribbons, we're gonna cut the curling ribbon to the balloon, creating the illusion that it's a hot air balloon. It's as easy as that. Now it's time to accessorize. This is where your creativity can take flight. For Valentine's Day, I've selected a fun unicorn plush to put in our gift, but if you were to do a baby shower or a birthday gift, you could add candy, gifts, mugs. Sky is the limit. 
I'm just gonna nestle him in the basket to complete the gift. And make sure you fluff your shred to make it more polished and look like a beautiful presented gift. And there you have it, a beautiful hot air balloon gift, perfect for your special Valentine. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook.